Hey guys, um, it's me, Haley, and this is part two of How to Make an American Girl Off Closet. Sorry last time um, on part one how um, it kind of got cut off. I didn't say that this is part one, but you'll see the title. So this is part two, okay. So let's start. So you already taped the back like this, and this is what you have so far. All taped and everything. See? So sturdy. It's kind of. <laughs> so sturdy. Gosh, it's so big. Okay, I won't do that again because I'm videotaping. Okay, we we're wasting time, so we gotta get this done. Okay, next you're gonna need a sheet of paper, and I don't even have one. Uh, one sec. One sheet of paper. One sheet of paper. Okay, and one sheet of paper is almost the size of this Kleenex box. So you're gonna need to cut off a little of this like right here. And you'll see why. Okay. Oh my gosh, perfect. Okay. We're working on the paper so we don't need the actual closet right now. What you do with the paper is you start rolling it up. Okay, just like throwing a project up or something. But you still want it to be kind of thick and not too thick so the hangers can get on, okay? Okay, this is how you test it out. If you don't have hangers, you'll see at the end. But if you do... I guess it's a little too big, but it will work. Oh, sorry. I thought I heard the fire thing going off. Okay. Guess what? I did this wrong. Alright, okay, sorry. We're going to do it over because I did it wrong. There. Okay, right, now. Perfect. It's long enough. Maybe I shouldn't have cut out that much. Let's see if it's long enough. Yeah, it's just long enough. Okay, lucky. Well, sorry. I better get the tape before it unrolls. Okay, just so keep your tape on your table. Oh, now, you tape the sides right here so it doesn't, so it stays, you know, not loose. See? Now it's not unrolling. But now you gotta do the bottom so the bottom doesn't unroll. Or doesn't look good. Or look bad. Okay, one sec. Now, all sturdy. Okay, so we'll see if it is the size of. It is the size of this. So, this is what it's gonna be. You're gonna take the walls like that. But you want to make sure that you tape it kind of close, be cut close, like right here. Like you tape it like right here, because if it's all the way back here, the hangers aren't gonna fit what um right. Because look, this part is long, right? If you put it right here, that will work. It's not gonna hit this part, okay? So I hope you understood that. If you didn't, then sorry, but I can't help you then. And what I was saying, you might need this part is I was thinking that you could add some decoration to your closet and do something like that but I don't like that so I'm not gonna do that but if you guys like that you can de decorate it however you want so it's yours okay so now you made your tube <laughs> what you're gonna do is you're gonna stick it in your closet like I said don't do it too far up and don't do it too high okay that will work. That will work. So I'm going to do that, and if you didn't understand that, I'll show you again. Okay. Okay. Perfect. I'm wasting time right now. i got to hurry. I don't... I might need a part one. I mean a part three. I don't have time for a part three. Okay? So. And I don't want you guys being like, oh, when I cut you off at that one part... I don't want you being like, oh, that sucks, you know, like, 
Okay, so this is how you try it. There. Okay, I'm almost done. One sec, guys. Probably isn't entertaining or helping you at all when I'm just doing this myself. And I actually thought of this idea myself, so I did not get this from any YouTubers. Okay. Okay. Almost there. Oh my gosh, this is perfect. I'm so happy. We might need duct tape, so. It is a big closet. And you want it to be equal. You don't want it to be like lopsided, like this part hanging down crooked. Because then it will fall. And if it does fall, you just do it again with some heavier tape. Like, I'm going to add some polyester tape onto it, I think. Or possibly glue it. That would make more sense. Okay, like I said, we're running out of time. Okay, so there you have your wall. And this is how you try it out to make sure it's not too small. I also have to show you guys how to make a hanger if you guys don't have a hanger. Oh, wait a second. Oh, there we go. It's perfect. Okay, now what you're going to do, you might think more and more. That girl's crazy. Okay, so let me decide one more piece of tape real fast. I get crazy over tape. Oh, uh, so, here you have it. I already showed you that. So, and like I said, if you want to add design, that's fine. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to add all your hangers. And in part three, if you guys have many hangers, which I'm sure you do, then, um, if you do, then you don't need to see part three. So part three is just if... You don't know how to make it. You know what? I probably... There. So that's what it'll look like as up with clothes. How does it look, people? People of the world. It's going to look better when it has clothes, okay? I hope you guys enjoyed this wonderful video. I'm going to take all these off right now. Okay. So, guys, part three. Please watch part three and is how to make um, a hanger if you don't have one. If you already do have these hangers, don't watch part three, okay? Bye, guys.